Kira, good to see you again. Um, another big performance in there as well today in a, a, a really top class field as well. Um, how did that swim feel for you? Um, it, it didn't feel bad, like the time wasn't great, but it felt all right. But pretty cool swimming next to the world's best and yeah. Absolutely, because this is a great opportunity just for you to focus on personal best, focus on your personal development, whilst also rubbing shoulders with some of the elite of the world. That must be a great feeling. Yeah, it's really cool. Like, see them all at dinner around the village and on the buses. Like, our physio was sat next to the guy who got bronze in the men's 400, which was quite cool. She was just chatting to him. Great to see them, isn't it? These moments don't come around all too often. The fact we've, we've said from the start with yourself that you, you just seem so calm and collected going out there, just focusing on your own game. No one would think, you know, you, you're 17 years of age, you're here on the big stage, you just seem so relaxed about everything. Do you feel like you can just enjoy this experience at the moment? Yeah, I'm trying to enjoy it, but I'm just trying to, like, obviously I'm chasing PBs, and I want to get PBs, so I'm just trying to focus on my own race. Not worry about what they're doing, because they're going to be miles ahead, because they'll be chasing world records. But, yeah, I'm just trying to do the best race that I can. Because it's quite a long slog, 200 metres as well. Do you have to sort of keep it in your mind not to try and get ahead of yourself and push too hard? going towards maybe the midway point or whichever, just trying to keep everything in the tank as much as you can? Yeah, pretty much on the first length, like when you dive in or do your start, just want to get out there and sprint, but if you do that, you'll die on the back end, so you've got to try not to. And um, speaking of some of the ones that are actually in the village, like you say, like some of the top names, have you had the chance to chat with any of them and maybe pick up a few tips along the way or anything like that? Um, I haven't really spoken to any, I'm a bit shy anyway. <laughs> well, but, to to them. Uh, plenty of time for it, I'm sure they'd have more than make enough time for you, but um, just one final question, I suppose going away from this swim, what are the sort of big lessons you're going to take from this one in particular and going forward for the rest of the games? Um, probably just trying to stay calm, keep my nerves under control, because I was a bit nervous for that one, especially. And yeah, we've got the 50 tomorrow, so hopefully I'll do well on that. Well, we look forward to it, Kira. Thanks very much. Thank you.